The variations actor is the link between the UI3 and the objects placed in the scene. It can change materials of meshes and the mesh used itself. Optionally, it can provide information and the cost of an object. It can also link to other blueprints using a blueprint interface. The object info actor can provide information and the cost of an object, but has no variation component. The variation actor lives in the UI blueprints folder. It needs to be placed into the same level as the static mesh actors that it is meant to change. Select the mesh and press M on the keyboard. This will make the static meshes level the active level. Variation actor type defines what the actor is used for. Changing the type will change the color of the variation actor sprite. Standard variation actor is the default. Link to designer needs to be set for actors that are used by the designer widget. Listens to other variations lets the actor be changed by another variation actor. A unique tag name is used to link the two actors. Only triggers other variations does what it says. The tag name will link the actors. Only triggers external actors can trigger any external blueprint in the scene. The tag name is used to identify which blueprint should be activated. The ceiling fan is an example for this. The blueprint interface, UI3 interaction, is the link between the UI and the external blueprint. List name is displayed in the widget and in reports. Default variation ID is set as scene default and can be used to browse through the choices. Static mesh actors in the scene can be connected with the eyedropper. Multiple meshes can be added and changed at the same time. Set the usage flags as required. Design schemes are explained in the features with preview quick guide. Edit mode is a widget that allows the user to change individual objects in the scene. Show in reports lets the actor appear in generated lists. The Variation Details array defines the look of the choice buttons. Every array element represents one button. Simple preview icons can be created with an icon texture and a tint color and will be displayed if Show Preview icon is clicked. Icon textures can be found in the folder UI Text Design Mat. Clicking Update Details from Previous will try to create the details array from data that has been entered in a previous version of the Variation Actor. It won't work if new data has already been entered. All arrays in the Variation Actor are connected by their index. Index 0 defines the first button. If the button is clicked, changes will be made to the meshes and widgets using everything defined in the first index for the arrays. Many static meshes have multiple materials. Each materials array element represents one of the materials. The material ID is the element index of the mesh materials. The material variations array is a list of material choices. In this example, the mesh has only one material and the ID is zero. Add another element to the material ID if more than one material on the static mesh needs to change. Enable mesh variations is optional and meshes will only change if the box is ticked. Variation meshes are set in the meshes array. Meshes and materials are linked with their index. A mesh needs to be entered multiple times to change the material and the mesh. Mesh transforms allows to offset mesh variations from each other. Ticking the box for Show Info expands the widget to display some basic information of the choice selected. Object Name appears on top of the Info section. Object Text can be a short description of the product. Object Image and Brand Icon are textures usually copied from the manufacturer's web page and then imported into Unreal's Content Browser.
the price set here will be overridden if a price is set in the variation details array. The info entered for index 0 is displayed for all choices if it is the only element added to the array. Ticking show detail prices and price units will add the calculation formula to the widget. Costs per choice can be added in the details array and will be displayed if the price is not zero. Cost tracking is optional and will be explained in a separate video.